My mom is here. I'm so proud of you. Not bad. <laughs> Good morning guys, welcome back to my channel, it's morning, I just woke up, it's 7.15 and I'm going to wake up Allegra, drive her to school, doing the mom tasks, also as you know my parents are here so you'll be getting a lot of my family inside of this vlog, a lot of Russian uh, speaking will be going on, which I'm sure you don't, you're not gonna understand anything but I'll be trying to uh, translate it and give you a little bit more insights of what we're talking about, also I'm going to work out and um, just work also we'll show you a little work process as well I'm actually funny enough I'm filming multiple things at the same time a vlog and a what I did day as well so a lot of work today guys recently I bought this I went to Whoop! I actually went to dermatologist to check one of my uh, moles because I wanted to remove one and she told me I have a lot of like blocked Worse, which like I know it doesn't seem like it but I guess to be really to like perfection she said I need to be focusing more on unclogging my pores because of the heat and I guess I use a lot of sunscreen it kind of gets clogged and she recommended me to buy this soap for $12 on Amazon <laughs> And guys, I swear I could see the result within two days. I put it in a little like box because it's, you know, like it's a little messy, but it's really one of these products that are working. There is some sort of ingredient in it that basically helps to really clear the pores very well. And I use it only once a day because it's a bit drying, but it's not super drying. Like it's good balanced. Guys, good morning. Look at this little cutie. She is making up her room. I just walked in it's 7 30 we are getting ready for school and she is already tidying up her own room look at this cutie and you know why because yesterday we turned her bed her crib into a bed i know a lot of you were like what are you doing your child is like still in the crib honestly i wasn't rushing it i think it's okay if your child is in the crib until they want it there's nothing wrong with that so the time has come and she actually asked for the bed herself i changed her bed and I made a little door here you see it's a special crib that turns from a little tiny crib in a bigger crib and now it turned into a toddler bed where she can come in and out and today was her first night <laughs> I'm Mama, you, you, you woke up and did you did, did pee pee by yourself yeah. yes <gasps> you are so smart Amore. I'm so uh, proud of you uh, Mama, I you want to tell Papa that you come out by yourself? Okay, I'm so proud of her. <laughs> it's this little moment of achievements that makes the moms proud so much. <laughs> but yeah, I wanted just to mention here that I think that every child has their own timing with certain things. Like it's the same as I, you know, she was drinking milk from a bottle and I didn't give her a pacifier, but then over time she got used to falling asleep with a little bottle in her mouth, pacifying it. And a lot of people were like, what are you doing? This is crazy, la la la. You should teach her out of it. I obviously was planning to, but I wasn't rushing it too much. I didn't feel like she was ready for letting it go. It was her like comfort thing. And then at some point, uh, you know, when she was already old enough to understand the concept of like, okay, Allegra, now it's time to say goodbye. You know, and she she went herself to the show, she it away herself. She cried for a few days, but then she got over it very quickly. So don't rush things sometimes. Don't rush things just because somebody told you or you read on the internet that until a certain age, they need to let go of certain things. Try to feel your child and listen to your mom intuition. That's for sure. That's never tells you wrong. <laughs> Right? Did you tell Papi? Yeah. What did he tell you? Good job? Yeah, good job. But he told me amazing. Amazing! I know, it's so amazing. You're such a big girl. <laughs> you know, now you're going to be sleeping like a big, big girl. And the fact that you're tidying up her, your room before the money came, it really shows how big girl you are. Yeah. Yep. I'm so proud of you. I'm so, so proud of you. <laughs> Let's go brush your teeth.
I'm gonna give you the little uh, thermometer downstairs. We're gonna measure the fever and we see, and we see if you really have a fever, okay? Mm -hmm. So let's pick the little clips. So which one you want? Do you want the unicorn? You want the cloud? You want the other unicorn? Or you want the... Amor, don't play with that. That's not a toy, sweetheart. We don't play with that kind of thing, my love. Okay. Okay, sweetheart, which one you want? You want the unicorn? You want the cloud? You want another unicorn? Or you want the rainbow? I want two of the unicorns. Just two of the unicorn? Mm -hmm. Okay, that's a good idea. My mom is here. I just came back from a workout and as you saw, I already bought a little pastries for her. Sorry guys, for one second. So I uh, got them. I got them little pastries. He is trying to convince me to eat it too and I told him I'm not going to eat it because because I'm not going to eat it because I just worked out and I actually going to a trip in a week so I was like okay I'm gonna behave before my trip I usually do that like I do like a cleanse of a body where I don't drink for two weeks before the trip I don't eat sweets <laughs> two weeks before the trip so I can go all out when I'm on the trip and then I also do the same when I coming back from a trip kind of just like getting back to my routine and cleanse myself out a little bit I'm not even really believe in this cleansing but you know what I mean like being out of alcohol and sweets kind of makes you feel better not gonna lie guys this is a backstage of me shooting my what i did in a day video and it just takes 15 minutes to convince my dad to switch out the old school russian music from here because you won't be able to hear anything we are made a breakfast so we're going to have a breakfast now film what i did in a day as well and watch the vlog that is coming out this week multitasking over here okay <laughs> um, my dad suggesting us to film our breakfast under the rain. I think it's a great idea. We're just gonna have a breakfast under the rain. Great idea. Ты что там делаешь? Вы какую-то Это соус. Это соус. My father coming out with a different recipe. It's a sour cream mixed with jam. Signature recipe. He said that everyone in a restaurant does it. Fine. Okay. We are reviewing the vlog that is coming out today, so let's see if I'll get the approval. how is my facial routine is and honestly I used to do just facials like for pleasure because Guys, wanted to share with you my recent purchase. I actually wanted to buy this boot for probably multiple seasons because it's pretty, it's been around for a while and I feel like it's one of these classic boots that will not go out of style and will just like stay with me forever. It's this brand called a Paris Taxis and they make this like classic, beautiful, pointy, high heel boot that is just perfect length. I'm gonna show you now. And I mean, it's not really too useful for Miami but for example I'm going next week to New York I think it's gonna be just perfect for New York you see they made like as a snake pattern they're not snake skin just for your information Greenpeace don't attack me but they're just regular leather with a little like pattern on it super cute I also got another skirt that I actually never unpacked so I'll try to unpack it now to see how it looks so I'm actually kind of preparing myself and the looks for New York will I guess take you along also guys I wanted to remind you I have an Instagram account where I share a lot of style and spots like a lot I make this little real videos with all the tags and everything of my favorite favorite looks so make sure you are following me there as 
well i'm gonna remind you the instagram handle here because i know you are a lot asking me about more fashion content and i do love to film fashion content but i still feel like i want to do more like personal stuff and vlogs together with fashion content but there you're purely getting almost every day the fashion and spots and things that i wear so make sure you're there as well <laughs> this is another boot that i'm actually preparing for new york and this ones are from genvita rossi i not lying i bought them maybe five years ago okay a great quality they look like new also probably i wear them <laughs> not as much but it's one of this example when you buy a classic shoe it can last you a long time and you don't need to buy it every season so for example this and this piece is two are great investments for boot it's not trendy it's not gonna go out of style it's always gonna look relevant so highly recommend you to look into those type of shoes so yeah 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 less trendy more classy that's my motto sometimes i like trendy not gonna like okay guys so also i wanted to film my work process from my messy bedroom i actually have a partnership to film i have to do a reel and this is for this great brand called page i'm sure you guys know this brand look how awesome this this jacket and pants it's like a suit made out of velvet material is it velvet i don't know if it's velvet or there is another name to it i think it's velvet i think it's velvet so i selected the looks that i want to film for this reel and the idea of the reel will be me living in page in a different situations of life like going to the office going to date night go to girls night daily outfits so will be different styles within the page collection whenever i need to film this kind of styling jobs i love to do a little mood boards and that's probably coming from my modeling background I know what it takes to film things and produce a photo shoot and on every photo shoot there will be always a mood board with makeup direction hair direction with mood and just like looks put together so I made a very simple one I just cut out the looks and I wrote like slick hair date night wave whatever so this way I also can kind of even so it's not a lot of look but I feel like I'm visual kind of type person so for me it's very easy to execute the job and be more focused if i visually know what i'm doing and what we've already done so that's just my little tip for content creators to always do the mood board before the job it just helps you to get inspired to have vision more clear and stay focused okay now i'm getting dressed i'm gonna show you how i film for all my reels you saw guys on my instagram i have kind of the same background look be a because i picked the spot in my house which has a good daylight i think daylight is always a winner for the content also it has a beautiful uh, feature of the stone fireplace i think it gives like a classic look to my reels and i also want my styling reels being recognizable so that's why i picked the same spot let me know how you feel about the same spot choosing the same spot do you think i should change it up or you think it's okay to keep the same look i feel like it's okay like i want my reels to be recognizable so i'm filming it here i have this great tool for the content creators take a note i'm gonna show you this little tool that is so good so it's this suction cup thing that attaches to any like glass material you screw the camera on it and then you can place it either horizontal or if you want to film vertical you can place it the way you want it then you press it here and it really stays on the glass so tightly like it can hold so much weight and it's super safe for the camera so i just leave it here i already know the angle of the camera that you know that i have to film from and it just stays there i press record and i record the reel i already know exactly where i should stand so you'll kind of get behind the scene now also i forgot a little other tip a lot of times i like to choose the music that i'm gonna film for because sometimes i include like a little dance moves and if it's a slow song you can kind of feel the music and make a movement according to the song i feel like it makes also real more alive and more in line with the music and the style so that's also helpful to play the music that you're gonna film for while you're filming the content
Давай. Что, погнали? Погнали. погнали. Вот так. Сама пристегнешься или тебе помочь? Вот такая маленькая, да, была. Вот когда ты была малышка. Вот так. My mom's favorite store. Ну прямо. Мам, come on, favorite store. Нет. Already found some dresses. Мам, покажи. Basic ones, super cute. And the price point is very cute too. Надо померить. It's women's. Ну какой это women's? My dad and Allegra is picking the toys, and I just told my dad it was a section for dogs' toys, not for kids. I didn't know. Yeah, it's for the dogs and cats. We should find a section with toys for you, sweetie. Go look with with Grandpa. I don't know. Let Grandpa find where is the section with toys. Вообще очень милый. Where are you gonna put it? Only for three guests. Okay, guys, I didn't plan to buy anything here, but look at this sweater. Found this sweater, 100% cashmere for $100. I think it's pretty amazing. Pretty good deal. Look at my mom. We found her this cashmere set, also for $120 and I think $100. So all 100% cashmere. Looks so good. Okay, TG Max. Rule it. Not bad. <laughs> But my mom found this <laughs> basic dress, which I think is pretty good, and it's a really good, like, quality material, good price. We love that. Mm. My mom is feeling herself here. <laughs> I have to say, this sweater is so so good. Look at these buttons and everything; so well made. And this one, this pants are my favorite. It's 100% cashmere. I wonder which brand it is. It's from Naked Cashmere, actually, which is an amazing brand. I love it, and it's 100% cashmere. 120 dollars.